Constructive dialogue and engagement extends beyond Parliament to all Singaporeans. Ms Tin Pei Ling, Mr Daryl David and Ms Nadia Samdin spoke about the need to engage all segments of the community to tackle issues together and build consensus across different generations and backgrounds. And MOS Tan Kiet Hao and Pal Sek Rahayu Mazam spoke about how we should encourage such constructive dialogue, especially online. Now, that is one reason why we launched the Emerging Stronger Conversations. Minister Edwin Tong has explained how we hope to harness these as platforms to engage Singaporeans from all walks of life in honest and respectful conversation about the kind of Singapore that we want to build together. I've hosted several of these conversations where a myriad of topics were discussed, such as social mobility, racism and xenophobia, and our treatment of migrant workers. Participants were candid and raised suggestions that are worth exploring further. For example, some suggested setting up forums where people can talk openly and safely about difficult issues like differences in race, language, religion or class. Or reframing how charities work by using new funding models like social impact investing. We invite all Singaporeans to participate in these conversations, reflect on our experience together during this pandemic and take part firsthand in this important work of forging a shared consensus.